Hi, everybody. So I am going to give you a tour of my house in the metaverse. Um, I may or may not have had a party here the other day. And um, I forgot these little party sticks hanging around. So watch. Do you shake it or you break it? Ah, oh, this one's blue. So here's our box of goodies from the other night. Oops, I really need to... Oh gosh, I'm just making them spread more. Yeah, so these are a box of <laughs> little glow sticks that I guess I left here. And um, let's see, what color do you think this one is? Why is that not working? Come on, break! All right, well, this is, that one's broken. I don't like that one. <laughs> How about this one? Okay, let's try this one. Yeah, wait, this is <gasps> purple, cool. Anyway, so um, whatever, we'll clean that in a little bit. Um, let me show you a little tour of my house. Here, let's move this camera this way. This is the main view of my house normally. Um, shall we? Bring you a little bit closer. Uh-oh. Did I just take a photo? So when you first get into my house, you'll actually see that there's two dogs. This one is a little corgi. It makes a little noise when you pet him. So cute. This one I imported. I got this from Sketchfab. It's supposed to be Ari. It doesn't do anything. If anyone knows how to make the dog do something when I pet him, let me know. Um, let's go here. So I put these two trees because they're nice. Of course, I put little Pikachu there hiding in the tree because he's a detective Pikachu, right? Detective. <laughs> um, and, you know, just some cute campfire, some toasty campfire. I thought I deleted this. I don't know what that is. And we have a train in the sky. One of my friends brought in a train and I told him just to leave it. He I was like, you know what? That train looks good. Let's just keep it up there. The Mr. Krabs graffiti was not there. I don't know who I got the Mr. Krabs graffiti from, but somebody brought it and now it's here as a permanent structure. How do we get into this catamaran? You know, I've never actually gone into... <laughs> oh, bless me. Okay. Let's go into this catamaran. Ah! Oh, gosh. Oh, okay. Wow, we're such animals. There was a way to enter the other side. If I had just been patient, there's, there's a way to enter the other side. Okay. Okay, what floor? You know what? We're going to make this into a candy floor. It's VR and I can do whatever I want, you know? Hmm. That looks less candy-ish than I thought it would. Okay, let's pick this ice texture and see what that looks like. One more thing I need to change is this, this wooden thing is not the business. Let's change that out. Looks like an eye. Find out. Oh. Um... Is it tinted glass? You know what? We'll keep it. And it has a beautiful view. You know what? Maybe we should put some like plants here. Maybe that's the next thing. And then like a pool. Um, a pool would be nice, right? So you can look out into the horizon and just enjoy your life here. <laughs> Gosh, it's just like such a big mess here. I'm like, uh, whatever. Let's just leave it. It's it's fine. So there's always lo-fi music playing. It's, oh gosh, I really hope it's copyright free. Otherwise that would suck. But um, there's always lo-fi music playing in my home and a little torch. So I decided to make my house like an open concept, open floor plan. As you can see, there's only like two walls um, and one's not even a wall. It's like a window wall and there's a brick wall and then a little bit of flooring. I mean, you know. I wanted it to be open so that there's room to expand as needed. Uh-oh. Uh, just don't pay attention to that. That is nothing. Um, so I have this like little lollipop as a light source, which is like one of my favorite things. I love the fact that I have a giant lollipop as a lamp. I just... Ugh. <laughs> and um, yeah, then we have this little... Can I sit in this? No, huh. Anyway, so we have a peach, that's a peach, right? A peach chair. This, this little thing, um, science DNA, I think it's a DNA looking thing. Uh, that is for my best friend because she's a scientist. So I told her that I would have some stuff here for her. 
And, oh, this is a photo of uh, when my friends and I hung out in Neos the other day, well, a couple months back. Uh, and then we took a photo together and now it's framed in here. You know, I'm thinking about bringing in some, oh, what's it called? I'm thinking about bringing in some photos from the real world into Neos and then having that like, or ha into my metaverse home and having that dynamic of meshing them all together could be interesting. Let me eat this cookie. No. Okay, well, you know, I'll show you what that does in a little bit. Um, there's a mushroom for a table and some tissues. Like, hey, and you're probably going to ask me, like, why do I have the most random arrangement of items in this home? Well, let me tell you. Uh, usually when people come to visit my house, I just tell them, you know, if they have something cool that they want to leave here, like, go for it. And then people come in here and move things around. Like, you know, all these plants before used to be on this weird stand looking thing, but then somehow the stand disappeared. So someone came in and just rearranged the plant <laughs> arrangement in my house. And it just, oh, it looks so good. I'm so proud. And then this is, <laughs> this is pretty cool. So this thing right here, I don't know why it's permanently at this angle, but basically someone 3D scanned their breakfast in real life. Like this is a real 3D scan of someone's breakfast. And yeah, they 3D scanned it and someone was trying to show me in VR. They said, look at this. Um, someone three, and then I was just like, can I have that? So we were trying to put it on the table because I want to have more food in here, but it's not, for some reason, it's not going in a horizontal. I don't know why. I don't know how to fix it. So we decided that it can just be artwork. It can be a, an artwork of food. I don't know. <laughs> um, yeah. And then the last thing in this household that you must see is my yacht. It is a fully functioning yacht. Wait, what? Where did this come from? I've not seen this before. Okay, well, there's a map of the yacht, I guess. I don't know why it's floating in the air. Honestly, people come in here and change some things around, and I don't really mind. To be honest, I don't mind. Like, in the real, in my real house, in the real world, I would... Oh, there's fridges in here. Can, and they open. Okay, obviously, I don't explore enough in my own house. This is a kitchen? Okay, so in my real house, I do care a little bit more when people put things... And there's a microwave and... Wow. Oh my gosh. We need to put some food in here ASAP. Like, yeah, we need to have some food in here because it's just awkward if people come and visit my yacht and there's no food. Okay, anyway, let's go up this thing. Okay, like in the real world, I would care a lot more if um, things were out of order, but in VR, it's supposed to be surreal and wild and crazy. I mean, if you want it to look like the real world, of course you can, but to me, I feel like this is opening up Pandora's box to our creativity in a, vir a beautiful virtual world. Mm. Well, didn't think I'd forget this, did you? Well, here it goes. <laughs>